Welcome to Memphis. TD, I got you. Baker Mayfield going crazy, throwing lasers. TD on the sticks, you know what can save you. Still form from forming, got him staggering and dropping like he just took a punch from forming. Yeah, can't nobody do nothing with me. And my defense looking sharp like the claws of a Memphis Grizzly. Crowd going wild, screaming my name. Big sack, Brian Burns lead the field in flames. Insane, we stand tall like the pyramids. Go ahead and get the trophy ready for the Memphis Egyptians. Egyptians season two. Blah. We got a new rookie quarterback. We had so much to talk about. Guys, if you guys want the next episode of this to come out as soon as possible, 10,000 likes. I will do everything I can to make that possible. I love you guys. We have so much. I freaking love this franchise, man. Shout out to Memphis. Boom. Look on the screen. Um, We got a lot to unpack. Week one, we got the Denver Broncos. Guys, uh, in case you missed last video, I'm going to give you guys a catch up of our draft, our off season, everything that kind of went down. And then I'm going to be letting you guys know the decision on who I'm going to be starting. The rookie, um, Evan Thomas out of Purdue, or Baker Mayfield coming off a really, really, really good year. Um, and I'll give you guys my reasons, um, both sides, why I kind of feel that way. And yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, um, first things First, let's go over our free agency. We signed Darnell Savage going into the season. We signed him last video. He's going to play free safety for us, uh, potentially be our user sometime. 93 speed, 93 acceleration. 27 years old. I got him on a pretty good deal. Like, I, I, I paid for him. Don't get me wrong. Like, he gets about $10 million a season. I think he adds that value. He's a great safety, good height. He's not undersized. Uh, he moves around really, really well. Ball hawk type safety. Other new faces. Um, someone I am extremely, extremely pumped to see on this field is a guy by the name of Kevin Baldwin. Kevin Baldwin, six foot one, 234 out of Ohio State. Hidden depth. He was the highest rated rookie. I'm pretty sure, if not, or maybe second. He was one of the best rookies. He Mock draft-wise, he went super early. Nobody took him. Um, I drafted him in the second round. Dude looks like just an absolute beast. 92 speed, 91 acceleration. Uh, he's going to play middle linebacker for us. I cannot wait to see him on the field. Now, Mar this guy. Bro, this one. There are so many people in the league being like, oh, I should have drafted this guy. When, when I picked him, a lot of guys were thinking of drafting him near me. 5'9", 2'0". I, I drafted him because he was a receiving back. I was expecting maybe 91, 92. 93 speed, 94 acceleration, hidden dev, and it just comes into the league as a 73 overall. Guys, I look at this guy in our shotgun sets, he's going to start. He's going to play a lot for me. I, I just, I really, 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 really feel confident about him. The main decision, Evan Thomas. We drafted him with our first round pick, six foot seven, 247 pounds out of Purdue, 23 years old, um, 96 throw power. 74 speed, 78 acceleration. Dude is just a true pocket gunslinger. I asked you guys the question, Baker Mayfield, and I have made a decision, and I'm going to announce it right now. Thanks to you guys' help. Guys, Baker Mayfield um, had such a good year last year. Such a good season. I think what bugs me, and I do want to go over this because I, I really love him, is just this. Skill regression. Look at this. Look, at, he, he was regressing all throughout the late, um, the late minus eight total. So I think he, we ended last season as a 75 overall um, through that really good year. And we're down again to a 73 overall. But just because of that, guys, to start the year, I am going to be giving the rookie Evan freaking punch him in the face, Thomas. Bigger Ben, uh, he's gonna be our starting quarterback. I'm giving it. I have not started a rookie, like a drafted rookie in a very long time. Um, it's gonna be interesting, man. He his stats, really, really, really good. Gunson, we're gonna play a certain type of offense with Evan Thomas. Um, I would have Purdue, man. The guy, the guy just he's got flies. QB of the future, likely to start above similarly rated player. Team is likely to draft a replacement for this player. So, like I said, he's got his motivations. I think he is the guy. He's going to be starting with a very... He has weapons. That's the thing. Last year, we pick up Divins. Divins has an amazing, amazing, amazing season for us. Um, ends up winning in a major award. 2023 Offensive Rookie of the Year. 
Third round pick. He's got Divins to throw. We know what Divins can do. Divins is an unbelievable receiver. Star development. Chenault, who last season ended up getting a dev upgrade. Uh, he's really, really close to getting short and elite and becoming an absolute matchup nightmare. Um, from his good season, he is still a superstar. DJ Moore, he can throw at DJ Moore. Guys, he's got weapons. That's the thing. That's not an easy decision. Is kind of what I'm saying. I really, really loved Baker Mayfield. I, it's honestly just the game. It's the game, seeing him throw 55 touchdown passes at 29 years old, and then making his stats worse. I think that is the main thing that led to that decision. So in this video, guys, we're about to get a day to view. Brian Burns last season also got upgraded um, to an X Factor. So deserving. The guy was disgusting. Like, I have never seen a more dominant player than Brian Burns last season. Akeem Ekwanu, um, he's getting close to having... Pass protector ability is actually only one upgrade now away from getting some of those passing abilities, which we've been waiting for. Um, currently, he just has nasty streak, but they're going to come. He's great tackle. Terrence Bramble. Love him. This was another hit last year. We have hit on a lot of, like, this year um, in my in my Bears franchise, my draft picks, eh. This franchise, we have hit a lot. Second round pick. Our second round picks have been fired. Um He's been really good. He got better last year, just a lot better. Wheeler, another one. Um, we're just, we're waiting on him, you know? Number four overall pick. I would say he would potentially look at his season if he could talk um, as a bit of a disappointment. So as do I. Um, but I think things are going to change. Frank Steele, we drafted him last year. The smart pick, that was a late um, that was a late first, I think, or early second that I got from somebody 24 years old. Uh, he's a great run blocker. He plays guard for us. A beast. Avion Newton. This is part of the reason why I did not feel the need to look at a corner. This was a fourth round CPU draft pick last season uh, who just hit 93 speed. He had a really good year last year. I love Avion Newton. Now, this is the one that's Amare Barna. Um, this guy's different. I gave him some snaps last year. In a lot of big time games, four and a half sacks, seven TFLs. His size, there is not a better combination of um, speed, speed and size in the game, other than Montez Sweat. Montez Sweat's the only person who could even kind of compare to his size and speed and just how quick he is. Um, We'll do the depth chart here, the official depth chart with you guys. Like I said, I, I enjoy this, man. Evan Thomas, I had already made the decision, is going to be our starting QB. Um, our starting running back in most sets is going to be Foreman, with Branch being our third down running back, unless something changes. Jamie Divins, um, Chenault, and DJ Moore. Tight end, Tommy Tremble. Left end, Akeem Ekwanu. Left guard, same as last year. I'm doing the exact same thing. Frank, the man of steel. Uh, we have a great left side of our offensive line, a super dominant. Austin Corbett and then Tyler Morton, who's a good pass blocker. He's going to be playing over there. Left end, Brian Burns. Right end, this is the where it's tough. I'm in between a couple, man. I really, really, really am. Barno is going to... Barno can play a rush D tackle. I actually think Barno can play here. Like, I literally could put Barno. Barno might. I am considering... I want to see how much of a mismatch Barno is at defensive tackle, you know? That way, Wheeler can still get his reps. I need Wheeler to be a beast. Like I said, he's number four overall pick. I can't have him on the bench again this season. The dude's got to play a lot. What is going on? Okay. Um, I think he must be starting here. Yeah, that, that's what's going on. Okay. Easy fix. Shh, Brett, chill out. Um, Wheeler, I'm going to play him there. Right end, uh, we'll go Brian Burns. And then defensive tackle, Amari Barno. And then in other sets, um, you'll obviously have uh, Gross Matos come in. DBs, Dante, JC, Avian Newton. Boom, that's four great DBs, all of them. Darnell Savage is going to be our true safety. Terrence Bramble is going to be our true strong safety. He's going to be out there all the time. Our sub linebackers are going to be Jeremy Chin, uh, Kevin Baldwin. And then our third one, I believe, I had this kind of in my head, but I don't know if it's... Who's going to be our third one? Potentially Savage. If I need, if I do need another sub linebacker, I think it will be Savage. Um as far as corners, I got slot corner. We'll go with JC Horn and then Texada on the outside. Guys, this is a squad, bro. Um, if I were the league, I would be a little bit worried. We're coming. And we're, we're that's all I'm going to say in the words of Deion Sanders, man. I'm coming. This rookie QB, I cannot wait to see what he can do. Um, 
getting his first start here against Denver uh, in a home game. Ladies and gentlemen, year two, let's go. They're gonna try and throw. Yo, that's begged. Avion Newton! Okay, ladies and gentlemen, slow music. It's time to get the rookie QB on the field. Let me go do my adjustments here. Um, we're about to see the debut of Evan Tom. Okay, let's go. Oh my gosh, Evan. Okay, Evan Thomas, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my goodness. Yo, look at the running. Okay, I see you, Branch. I see, don't think I don't see you, Branch. Oh my gosh, good run. Good run for Branch, okay. Like I said, the thing about Evan Thomas that I just love is his size, man. He's just, it, he's an intimidating guy. Like at six foot seven, you know he can make every single throw on the football field. Oh my God. Laser! Voice crack! Oh my gosh! Okay, it's early. That's our first drive, obviously. But Evan Thomas just stands there, bro. I don't feel like I have to really do a lot of moving and like, he is the pocket. Yo, Darnell! Savage! Welcome, Darnell. What a pickup. Oh my gosh. I feel great about this Memphis defense. I really do. And I'm not just saying, I really feel good about this Memphis defense. We are fast and we are so talented. Like, our pass rush, our secondary, this is a championship defense. It really is. I, I, I believe that. Uh, good throw. Holy man, Terrence Bramble for being undersized can hit, man. Holy moly, he can hit. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. He'll get this to his Good hit, Brian. Oh, okay, he's worn, he's heating up. Get to him. Oh, wow. Jeremy Chin. Yo, that's... Even though he got he gets the first there, that's great effort by Jeremy Chin. Really great effort. That's JC, bro. JC. Ah, that's a good play. Yo, give it to Branch. Good run, Branch. I'm looking for a few things with Branch, if I'm being honest. Um... And that's this first game, and like I, obviously I'm trying to just see what we got in Branch. I want to see if this guy can just pretty much just just take a lot of this shotgun run and how see he's just explosive. I like that about him. If you watch that play right there, he was very 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 quick off the line, and that's that's just something a little bit different than um, than we have in Foreman. Okay, Evan Thomas. Evan Thomas. Jimmy Divins! Let's go! Evan Thomas is fearless, bro. Dude does not fear anybody or anything. Oh my goodness. Okay, I love that. That 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 was just a big time. Like I'm just that was that was called just trusting your guy. On first down, Thomas. Yep, Chenault. Nice catch, Chenault. Go Branch. Oh my gosh, Branch. Good job, Branch. And the stiff arm at the end. I like that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! Evan! What a laze! Shut up, Evan Thomas! Yo, that was a beam. Come on, Dante. Don't let him beat you, Dante. Yo, Zach Sarah is legit. How fast is that guy? Cecil Brooks, rookie. Yo, he got him a weapon. Yep. Tommy Tremble. Get up field, Tommy. Cut on him. Go, Tommy. Yo, what a play. Yep. Go, Chenault. Up field, Chenault. That's a first. Throw again. Mm, good defense. 
Yo, good job, Evan. Way to step up. Okay, third and eight. If it's cover two, man, I might have to go up to the kid. I might have to throw it to the kid named Jamie Divin. Yep, just throw it, Evan. Just throw it, Evan. First down. Let's go. Good stuff. I'm looking for cover zero on the left. Jamie. Yo! What a dog, Rook! What a dog, Rook! Oh my goodness. Okay. Jamie, it's good to see Jamie Divins, bro. This is year two Jamie Divins. That was a perfect throw from Thomas. I'm seeing some beautiful things from Evan Thomas. I don't know. I'm not trying to jinx anything. I don't want to sit here looking at you guys and hype it up if I don't think it's legit, but I think we may have found our quarterback. I feel like he could be a difference. Like, I feel like he could be a guy on this team that we look at and is like, oh, wow, that guy's amazing. Oh, I just tried to play some wild coverage. I think it may have paid off, though. Let's call timeout. Let's, let's, let's force him to call a play here. Yo, are you running this football? Nope. Sick throw, actually. I love that. Now a play fake here on first down. Oh, he'll air this one deep for Judy. Yo. We're getting, yo, this Zach Sarah kid. Holy moly, we're getting torched. Thomas on third down. Just be smart on third down. Like, I can give this ball to Branch and get a yard. I just know it. No way. Yo, what on earth is going on? I, I'm honestly, I'm baffled. Why was my cover two man like that? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we got a tie game. I don't even know what to say. Yep, there we go, Tommy. Go, Tommy Tremble. Go. Oh, my gosh. Okay. I see you, Tremble. Yep. Just be smart. It's a fumble. It's okay, though. Good play. Good play. Good play. Good play. Yo. That, that's what Branch brings. That right there is what Branch brings. Put him out as a receiver, and good things can happen. Am I going to go up top here? Is it cover zero? No, it's not, but I still got him. Jamie Divins! Let's go! He's too strong, man. That's good defense. I like that. Yeah, there we go, Jeremy. Take one back. There it is, Jeremy Chin. Okay. Yeah, good read. Good quick read. Good quick read. Good quick read. Oh, we're close. We're super close. Tyler Bias. I think that's five touchdowns. I don't know. I don't know who's counting, but that might that might just be five touchdowns. Hit him though. Hit him, guys. Hit him. Good job. Look at Kevin Baldwin getting there. Yo, if you're buying jerseys, I think I would buy Kevin Baldwin's. There we go. CJ, make up for it. Oh my gosh. Avion. No, he doesn't have it. Fourth down. Back to throw here. Got his man. It's Thomas. Touchdown. Just getting lost. On second down. Oh my gosh. Good cut, Branch. Dude, I did we did we get two pretty game breaking rookies on offense here? I don't know. No different as we come up on a first and ten. Good throw. Easy throw for Evan Thomas. Good throw, Evan. Go, Evan. Go, Evan. Oh, I'll take the delay. I think it's we got to go up 10 here. And our, our defense needs to come up and make a stop. I think that's the main thing. Our defense desperately um, needs to come out here and get a stop. So 
Lutz. Will Lutz, our new kicker. Simple. Got it. Okay. Hey, plus 10. Good hit, Avion. Got him, Darnell. Love it, Darnell. Savage, let's go. I don't know, man. I feel like you go for this. Evan, Evan, what a laser from Evan with the game on the line. I'll run it again here. I just want to take another timeout. And potentially, yo, good catch. It's a beautiful cut by Branch. Yo, oh my gosh, we're still throwing lasers. Divins, got him, let's go. GG's, man. Boom! Oh my gosh, order the freaking Evan Thomas jersey. If you haven't already, consider ordering the Evan Thomas jersey. Holy schmoly. Okay, that was, there's a lot to unpack there. Um, we got a lot of upgrades as well from that game. That was, simply put, a very, very, very smooth, well-played game. And honestly, our rookie QB came out in his debut and threw six touchdowns, no interceptions, only got sacked once, shout out to the O-line. Our rookie running back, Marlon Branch, 11, averaged 7.6. DJ Moore, 197. Tremble, Jamie Divens had three touchdowns. Defensively, we were weak. Um, we didn't get to the quarterback once, and we got a couple picks with Savage. Avion got a pick. Guys, that is about as great as a week one that you can have. I thought as a quarterback, dude, like just being straight up with you guys, he was slick out there. Like every throw was bang on the money. He was what I expected. With, with him coming in and just like the type of like, he was exactly kind of what I expected. The dude just like... Stepped up in the pocket. He made every throw look really easy. The deep ball was super, super, super simple. And we won this game. Jamie Divins gets another upgrade. Shout out Jamie Divins. He's getting another plus one um, to his deep threat, putting it up to a 72. I might start at some point going slot upgrades with him just to try and get him a little bit faster. But as of right now, those, those have just been working so good. Guys, hey, great team win. Great win. We'll see you guys week two. Where's your bubble, fellas? Night game in Memphis. Okay. Hey, great first game. I, uh, that's all I want to talk about. That was a great first game. We did everything right. This is this is a big one. Week number two. Um, and coming off a win like that, it's easy to get complacent. It's easy to forget about the run game. I wanted to see what we had. I really, really, really did. I was like, how good is this guy? I was kind of proven like, okay, you know what? This guy's freaking unreal. And that that's what we saw. In that game, I think our passing offense can go crazy this year, and I think it needs to. Um, going into the playoffs, just I think it's to, to be able to have someone like him. Do I want to go? I think I want to go field general with Kevin Baldwin. Kevin Baldwin was also another guy. If you guys were watching, who, in your guys' opinion, has been if you're watching right now, who, in your guys' opinion, was the most impressive in that first game? I think. I think it was Evan Thomas or Kevin Baldwin. Uh, Marlon Branch also looked really, really, really good. I'm going to keep doing elusive. He's got a 4,000 bar. It's hard not to give that guy the ball. I don't I don't like giving him the ball. Like, okay, you know how much I love Foreman. I'm, I'm a Foreman guy. In under center running, you will see Foreman. But, like, how do I justify, okay? Foreman, for whatever stupid reason, has a 17,000 XP um, to get an upgrade. To get one upgrade, I need seven. 17,000 XP. With Branch, I need 4,000. It's like, it's not, and he's hidden. Like, he could potentially be a superstar. There's just so many reasons to give him a chance. Jamie Divins, uh, he looked amazing. Still one of my favorite players I've ever drafted. I just, I find he's just, if you watch these games, he gets open and he catches everything. He does a lot of things very, very, very well out there. Um, we got the 49ers week number two. This isn't going to be a layup. This guy's good. He's beat me before this year. I, I know the 49ers are a great roster. He's got Trey Lance as his QB. Um, 
I think CMC, yeah, he's got Debo. He's got a rookie there. He's got, he's got some young guys, George Kittle. It's the defense that you got to worry about on this team, man. And it, this is going to be a really good test. Um, trying to stop Nick Bosa in that pass rush is not going to be an easy feat. It's game number two for Evan Thomas. Uh, first game, one of the best games that the NFL had in week number one as a rookie. Dude was phenomenal, but it's not about just about week one. It's who can do it all season. Uh, he's already almost at his upgrade to get to a 68 overall. Um, the man from Purdue, second start at home under the lights against a very tough 49ers team. Let's dance. Yo, thanks, Dante. Thank you, Dante. Good job. Oh, go! I love him! Baldwin! Oh, my gosh! Coolest Ohio State University's finest. Oh, I love this. What did I say first game? Yeah, he was just hit stick, hit stick, hit stick. Second game, dude gets a pick stick. Pick what? What I bet? I don't know. 7 0. Yo, yo, who got the TFL? Kevin Baldwin. Do you guys see right there? TFL, first play. Who else? Here's Lance. When he gets to him, Savage. Good defense, guys. Good defense. Third down. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. And he's got his man. He doesn't have it, though. He doesn't have it. Lance to throw for it on fourth down. Mm, that's all right. Oh my gosh, how did he know? I, I don't know how he knew I was going to leave it. That's a dot. That's a great throw. On second and a couple, Thomas. Flushed out right. Yo, Jamie Divins up top. Boom! Oh my gosh, you gotta have confidence to throw that. Sorry, just got attacked. Holy mo! You see that throw though? That's just I. He's just got so much throw power. He can throw that like confidently with him. I will throw that every single time. Cut back, Branch. That's all right. Yeah, there we go, Chenault. Most underrated guy so far. Easy, simple throw. Chanel on this team since day one has been the most underrated guy in my opinion. Yep. I see you, Tommy. I see you, Tommy. Lays on the freaking money to Tommy Tremble from Evan Thomas. And we have our first touchdown of the game. Okay. Hey. 14-7. Didn't see that coming. Thank you, J.C. Horn. Oh my gosh. Second down and right back to McCaffrey. And some space here. Touchdown, 49ers. i try something here. I just want to see if we can break one. Go, go, Branch. Go, Branch. Good run, Marlon Branch. On second and nine, Thomas. Escaping the pressure right. That's into a double team and it's intercepted. It's preferable to making the big mistake. The drive begins with a run by McCaffrey. And he's got room. And all the way. Try to get to the outside. Who will go got it? Who else? Baldwin and Barno. Good job, guys. Yeah, I clicked on for that one. Why is he calling a timeout? That's the that's the worst timeout I've ever seen. That's the worst timeout I've ever seen. Why on earth? Oh, you suck! That's the dumbest timeout I've unless he wants me to make a mistake. He might throw me a pick and get more points. That's the only thing I could justify this with. Like he literally believes he has such a good chance of me throwing him a book that that's worth it, which. I can't really say that that's dumb. Hmm. 
shot before half for Lance. Way to go, Burns. Okay. Second half, we get ball, guys. We need a better drive. Slicker drive. I'm mad about the second pick. Come on, Tremble. Just every time I've thrown to Tremble this game, it's been a pick. There we go. Good throw. Off play action. Thomas. Now he's gonna throw deep right side. He's got him in. Divins! Shut him up, Divins! Shut him up! Oh my gosh! Okay. First most impressive person on that play was Evan Thomas. The escape ability with the pressure in his face to make that throw was freaking unreal. Um, ladies, let's go. Okay, hey, forget the pick. Yeah, I put a zone there. Begged. Good job, guys. Okay. Should, I think he might take three or he's going to go to stack and try and hit me with that same play he just tried. He's taking three. Okay, let's go, man. Come on, Rook. Rookie quarterback, Evan Thomas. Can you manufacture another great drive like we just did to put ourselves in a very good position to win this game? Because we need to. Like I said, a couple bad mistakes. We need to. Yo, Evan Thomas on the money. Downfield, perfect. Here's Thomas. Yep, lays. Easy lays. Easy lays. Perfect, Tommy Tremble. Teams, if we can. Lays. What a throw, Evan! What a throw by Evan Thomas. Through the zones on the money. Okay, Will Lutz put us plus eight. Okay. John and Kate plus eight, baby. Let's go. Oh, hey, mm, we fight. We freaking fight on this team. 28-20. Yo, who else? The rookie. Oh my goodness. What a game for us, man. Shoot, I messed up. Hey, got him. Brian Burns. I'll use my last time out just in case he gets a touchdown here. 14 zones over there, buddy. Okay. He's got... Oh, he does have three timeouts. Got him. Quick lays, bro. Quick lays. Good throw, my guy. Good throw, Evan Thomas. Yeah, he ran commit. Up top, Jamie Divins. Okay, GG's, man. Give me a pick. Oh, good try, Avion. Good try, Avion Newton. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, um, we still, despite the mistakes, if like, mm, I made some dumb ones. Um, we still finished that game with an 80%. Let's go, Evan Thomas. Boom, plus one strong arm. Beautiful, up to a 68 overall. We still finished that game uh, with a very respectable 80% through the air. Um, a good passer rating and a 2-0 record, which at the end of the day, that's the only thing that matters is the fact that we are 2-0. Um, was it perfect? No. Did I make some mistakes? Yep, but a 118 passer rating. Jamie Divins, absolutely phenomenal game, dude. He was on that catch he made on that deep post. If he doesn't make that catch, I don't know for sure that we win that game. Kevin Baldwin, Baldwin, two TFLs, five tackles, one interception. That guy is freaking different. I, I just got to say, that guy is absolutely stupid good. Uh, we, have a, we needed that win. We got a tough game against eight miles next week. Um, coming up, which is no layup. It's no easy game. 
But through two weeks, I am very happy with where Evan Thomas is. Um, Ten touchdowns, two interceptions. He looks like just a gunslinger, bro. We're just throwing the ball around. Everyone's getting the ball, and we got a running back that through two games is averaging 71 and breaking some. So, guys, I'm happy with that. We'll see you guys week three. Ladies and gentlemen, week number three going up against eight Miles, uh, fellow YouTuber, this is gonna be a good matchup, guys. That's all I'm gonna say. This is gonna be a very, very, very good matchup. Um, he's a good player, went far in the playoffs. The Buccaneers just went 3 0. Um, as you can see, almost all the games are done here. That's wild. Um, T Sap just took down the Bengals 38 to 30. Holy, the Chiefs are putting up just stupid amounts of points right now, but they lost last year in the, in the thing. But okay, it's neither here nor there, guys. Not a ton to unpack in terms of upgrades, anything. I had none. Um, Evan Thomas, Marlon Branch, DJ Moore, Jamie Divins. I think Evan Thomas is off to a really good start in his career. I, I'm impressed. I, I don't know about you guys, but I like look at him and I'm like, yeah, this is this is the dude. I don't I don't know if it's can be any more simpler than he's making it right now. Like, yeah, I have no reason to be like, oh, I need to go back to Baker Mayfield. Baker Mayfield probably is upset. His morale's probably down. He's probably sad, and he deserved better. But sadly, the game just hates him. Marlon Branch, I know. I feel bad for Foreman, bro, but how do I not? How do I? Oh, my gosh. You know what I just freaking remembered? Okay, you guys told me, and I don't know how you know this, but everyone was freaking out. On I got, like, messages on Instagram and everything. Thank you, guys, telling me that this guy, I don't know how you guys know this, but apparently, apparently Kevin Bald was an X Factor. Apparently, I have no idea. Let me know how you guys know this because I don't know any of the tells or anything. If he is, that's bananas. He is a 78 overall, so I was like, he and he's been so good. He's my favorite player. I love Kevin Baldwin, bro. One interception, three TFL, seven tackles. Dude's gonna be on my field all the time. He's an absolute freaking stud. Shout out to Kevin Baldwin. Um, shout out to JC Horn, guys. Hey, this is a big game. Let's go look at the Giants roster real quick. Um, oh, Tua, I can blitz Tua. Tua, Slayton, he's fast. We played him and Evan Ingram, he loves throwing Evan Ingram. I remember from last season that you gotta blitz him. You gotta, you gotta scream, you gotta try and get pressure on him because if not, he's gonna dot you up. So ladies and gentlemen, week three. Here's tongue of Iloa on first and 10. Way to get down there, way to get down there. From midfield, here's Tua. Oh my gosh, let's go! Capers! Shout out King Capers. Okay, I see you. Jamie Divins. Jamie Divins. Man, I love that guy. Good job, Jamie. Huh. Not mad about that. I'm not mad about that. I. To me, in that situation, um, it's a one-on-one. -on -one. I need 10 yards. Potentially, I should have went just maybe with a curl or something from DJ Moore, but... Dang. Good hit. Good job, Bramble. Way to go, Bramble. Okay, we, we got to, like, let me just say, we got to find a way to get stops, man, because he's a very, get over there. Yeah, that's out of bounds. That's out of bounds. Yep. Thank you to a JC Horn. Bang, good defense. Fourth down, he should take three. He should. I'm guessing he does. Good defense. Boom, let's go. Okay. Offense, we gotta be better. I got behind the chains, like I, I did. I gotta run the ball better. I gotta trust the run more. Um, I gotta push the ball down field better. We gotta do a lot of things just different and better on this drive. Play smart, play smart. This is just two man all the way. This is two man. Go Branch, good run Branch. Against those two man looks, I have to be able to run like that. I don't think I have to overthink this. I think I might just be able to throw it to Tommy Tremble right there. Nice lays. Nice lays, Evan. Good throw, Evan. 
Yeah, Branch, you gotta go, buddy. Go, Branch! Go! Crib it! Good run. Yeah, I think I got him. Let's go! Good job, Chenault. Good run. And our O-line gave us time. That's so crucial. Our O-line gave us a lot of time. Okay. Up top, Tommy. Nice throw. 10 for 14. Third and long. Third and long, I don't hate the call. <coughs> That's just a throw. That's just a throw. Good throw. Hmm, good play. Yep. Yo, whoa, 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 way beyond. Come on, Tommy. Go up, Tommy. Go up, Tommy. Well done, Tommy Tremble. Well done. Go, Thomas. Okay, we're in field goal range now. Tommy, Tommy. Ooh. Mm. Go, Tommy. Go, Tommy. Tommy Tremble. Let's go, Tommy. Well done, Tommy. Ah, uh, Barno, get to him, Barno. Get to him, get to him, get to him. Come on, Avion, end it, buddy. Avion, oh my gosh. Like, that's not a good read. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. That's just not a good read. I'm not okay with that working. And I'm late on that. Dang, that's just freaking frustration. About two in a row, he's thrown that. Go, DJ. Good job, DJ Moore. Yeah, this is the money drive. We got to be smart, Evan. Yep, good job, Branch. I can realistically take this mm, to the end of the game if I'm smart. I'm taking this clock down a little bit. Yep, go, Marlin. Good job, Marlin. Not that I want, it's just, in this situation, it's just the most obvious decision that you can ever have, is that you gotta take the clock right now. Like, I, I have to. I have no choice but to try my best and take a little bit of this clock away from him. So that way I could potentially win with a field goal. Ah, uh, good try, Marlon. Love him, Jamie Divins! Lays! Now I can minimum, I can minimum give him ooh, very little time. Okay. okay, so he will realistically, I feel like I played that right. He'll have no timeouts. Okay, so... After the kick, he probably will have 15 seconds. You have got to be kidding me. Good game. Hey, that's a good one. What, I, I was in cover four. Like, what do I do there? I'm in cover four. I'm in backed off cover four. Like, why did that happen? In back, like, someone explained to me why I'm backed off cover four that Dante gets a 90. Like, explain this, EA. Explain it. A backed off guy gets beat on a streak in that situation. Explain to me. How in any way that is not ridiculous. And then I just let him do that, which was bad. I shouldn't have. I just hit him with 
Man on man. Oh my gosh. GG's. Hey, Evan Thomas played well. I thought we played well defensively. I thought we got a little bit cheated on some of those Avion Newton plays. Guys, we will not be having a perfect season. It is what it is. Um, hey, it's we're gonna have to battle, which we've come become accustomed to, you know? It's gonna be a tough, rough, ridiculous season, and we just gotta be better than it. So that's unfortunate. That's frustrating. Um Sad way to end. We put ourselves in a good spot to win by playing good defense, but at the end of the day, we just got cover four bombed. I don't understand how that worked, but see you in week four. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, week four, bro. Week freaking four. That was a, those are the L's, man. Those are the L's that just make you want to never play the game again. Those are the L's that make you contemplate your life and who you are. Like, those are the L's that just, oh my gosh, I don't even... Like, I have 15 seconds left. Cover four. Like, how did he get towards? But I got two options right now. I got to negotiate with some people. I, I can let it really get to me, or I can just bounce back and, and win. And pay. Pay JC. JC, you're worth that. I'll sign you for six, buddy, if you want that. Player friendly. Six years. I can keep. Boom. Hey. Welcome back, JC. That's, that's a positive. JC Horn is coming back. I just, I'm frustrated that Dante got burnt on that. I'm not even gonna lie. I just don't understand how cover four, end of the game situation, backed off, cover four, and it's just like, how? He just ran directly by him. It was the most ridiculous thing I've ever seen. Okay, we got the Saints this week. Um, let's have a look at just passing, see how we're doing with the rookie. 12 and three, I think we're, we're playing well with him. I, I, I do. Um, Jamie Divens has looked amazing. Defensively, I'm proud. I think this guy, Marlon Branch, has been one of the better running backs in the league. He's been super effective. Um, but now we're playing against a guy who can run the air out of the ball. Uh, he's not a great passer, but he can run. And he's our division rival, uh, the New Orleans Saints. He's 0-3, but this guy can steal some. If, if I go into this game upset, mad, thinking about the last game, I can easily lose this one. And I know I'm frustrated because the Bucks now has a lead, but it's early in the season, we take our lumps. And we just got to get better from it, you know? It's uh, That's just kind of the way it is. But, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I have no upgrades. I have nothing going on. Um, absolutely nothing. I, I want to talk. I want to say something. But I really got to... The most upgrade I'm most excited for is when Chenault, in one upgrade, gets short in Elite at 80 overall slot. Um, he's one upgrade away. So he's 8,000 XP. So excited for that with Chenault. This Saints team, I don't know, did he draft a QB? That's the billion dollar question here. Did Saints draft a QB? I'm curious. Uh, yeah, he did. He got Robbie Triplett. Yeah, okay, we can, we can play, let's go. Again, it's Camaro. And he's got some space here. And hmm, good run, good run. Do I just? Come here. Yo, that's out of bounds, right? Yes, sir. Good stand, guys. I think that'll hold them to three. Yes, yeah. okay. Whoa, Evan Thomas, let's go, man. Coming off of a bit of a rough game. Um, we gotta be better at this game. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna keep it real simple and just easy. We just have to be way better than we were last game here. Be smart, make good reads. We're gonna be just fine. Yeah, go Foreman! Upfield Foreman! Good to see him in the game. I love, don't get me wrong, I love Foreman, but I'm taking him out. Just because, it's just, if he was straight up, if he was just a little bit younger, Foreman would play every game for me. He's just, he's too old, bro. Oh my gosh, I had freaking X. Tommy Tremble, Tommy Tremble, nice catch. He did that last game too. He was doing that all last game. I love that. Third and 16. I want either 10 back or I want the whole thing. Okay. Holy. Oh my gosh. Okay. That happened. And we're just going to have to accept the fact that that just happened. Oh my goodness. 
I was trying to make, yeah, I was trying to make Blake. Yeah, he probably, realistically, I kid you not, Cameron is the type to be killing clock right now. Damn, good defense. He's the type to come out in this and try and like, try and take it to the half up 10-0 and just drain the clock, which I don't, you're 0-3. I'm not going to blame you for that, but that's definitely the type of guy he is. Nope. That's fourth down. Yo, why are we... Oh, my God. Too much time, man. Oh, goodness gracious. Holy moly. No. That's good defense, guys. Wheeler, good job. Wheeler, way to get to him. Okay, I don't know. Oh, he's taking the three. Cool. Okay, hey, ladies and gentlemen, offense, get back on the field and go freaking score. I'm going to keep it real simple. Let's not overthink things. We don't have a ton of time in this game. I got to get back out there. Yes, we're not playing great at the moment, but hey, we need seven. And when we need seven, we need seven. So. That's Jamie Divins, bro. Up top. Up top, Jamie! Good throw, man. To throw again on second down. Thomas. Now that'll be tipped and intercepted. Picked off by Paulson and Debo. And a safe because you're headed towards the ball. Bro, we are we're fighting it right. Good job, Baldwin. We're fighting it right now. I'm not I'm not gonna lie. This is gonna be one of, this is not gonna be a pretty game. I thought that that was a good throw. I really did. I wouldn't have thrown it if I didn't think so. Oh my gosh. He's gonna air one out. Touchdown, Saints. It's already looking to throw. Thomas. Second and ten, Thomas. Marcus May with a pick. And the Saints are going to... Wentz going to throw. And he's going to... Touchdown, Saints. Okay, I don't know, man. Well, we haven't exactly been treated to a nail-biter in this one, CD, and if they cannot score here, this one's pretty much all but over. And for the fourth time tonight, it's an interception. And the Saints are throwing his wins. Going for the deep ball. Good breakup. And I tell you what, he got it from 50. To throw is Thomas. Off the play fake. Go, Tommy. Go, Tommy. Just score. Please don't make me think about this. Just score. Like, honestly, just score. Worst game ever, just score, please. Good job, Evan. How many points? I need a lot of points. I had so many. But I honestly, the thing is, if I would have just not gotten so in my head... I think I could have won this game. I just like, even when I went down a little bit, I started playing stupid. Had I just ran the ball and stuck to my game plan, I think I think I have a chance. I need him to throw like a pick six on this drive. I need him to pass, because Cameron is not the best passer. So um, if I can get him to pass, that's probably my only chance. Good defense, push him back. Why is he going hurry up? See, to me, if I'm him, dude, I'm killing the clock. But he's no, hes actually, he might be killing the clock still. Big, good defense. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. He's got a man complete. He's at the 30. Shade it off, man. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Welp. 
Well, Merry freaking Christmas, everybody. Oh my gosh. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this will never be talked about again. It, it'll just simply never be talked about again. So, we're two and two. Um, I would be lying if I said the outcome of that second game didn't, third game didn't probably affect how I played in that fourth game. That's horrible. Horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. Guys, kill like button for the next one. Please, I want the next episode to drop as soon as possible. I'm sorry, that was the worst game of my life. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have a second channel where I post hockey gameplay. Please go subscribe. The nicest thing you did to me, just go check out that channel. Leave a like, even if you don't like hockey, give it a chance, subscribe to the channel. Uh, my Instagram is at BrettBQB. My Twitter is TDBearYG. I am a part of Top Dog Madden. You can get all the best tips at topdogmadden.com for your eBooks, all those type of things. Thank you guys so much for watching. Kill the like button again. If you haven't killed the like button on this video, do it. And once again, go check out my hockey.